right, today we're gonna to be making cilantro lime rice. This is one of my very favorite recipes. It goes great with tacos or burritos or... Yeah, if you're building a bowl, it's a great as a base with yeah. all the fun toppings on top. Like, this is something that is on hand in my freezer all the time. When it's not, it's like, what, where is it? And it's quick and it's easy. Yeah, so I'm Jen. And I'm Barbara. And we're with Pressure Cooking today. So let's get started. Okay, first off, we will add our water to the pot. Oh. You always want to make sure that the pot is in place. Um, we've got our water. And we should probably say today we're using oh. the new... Instant Pot Duo Crisp with Ultimate Lid. Um, right now it's a Target exclusive. Um, it has a um, pressure cooking cover and an air fryer lid kind of all in one. Uh, and we just we did, did a how to use it. Yes. So be sure and check that out if you... Yeah questions about that. So this is long grain white rice, so we'll go ahead and add that. And right now you want to add your salt. And this is the only time that you can season your rice. I had a couple times in a row, um, maybe two, three times in a row, where I forgot to add the salt and oil at the step. And my family banned me from making this on my own for a while because it you cannot come back from this. Like, you'll just need to make another pot of rice if you forget the salt and oil. It just tastes so much different. So go ahead and lock the lid in place. We'll hit pressure cook. Um, set the cook time for three minutes. Um, then hit start. And this one, we're going to do a natural pressure release for seven minutes, and then we'll release the pressure. Uh, that seven minute pressure release is super important mm -hmm. because that's when the rice steams and fluffs up. Mm -hmm. So don't skip that. Um, we're at about, what, 4,500 feet. Um, if you're cooking this at higher altitudes, you may prefer a four minute cook time. Um, we're just kind of on the cusp of that, uh, where if we're up too high, like if I'm cooking at mom's house, which is a little <laughs> bit higher up than mine, um, I'll you cook need it that for extra four minute. minutes, yeah. yeah. Okay, so our seven minute natural release is up. Just release the, any remaining pressure. Oh, nope, it's gone. We'll just go ahead and open the lid. All right, the rice looks awesome. Let's Cancel, just so it's use cooking. our rice paddle and fluff it up. Uh, if you don't have a rice paddle, you can use a fork, but it really does make a difference if you just fluff your rice a little bit. Okay, now this rice has kind of like a dressing that you add to it, so you add some Lime juice, some oil. oil. That's a cool shape. Put like a donut in there. Whisk those together, together a little bit. Is that emulsifying, Mom? Yeah. And, and then go ahead and add your cilantro. cilantro. So it's flavor packed. Stir that in. Good. Yeah, and then just dump it in with the rice and we'll mix it together. So this rice is great, like freshly cooked, but I love it like um, the next day after the flavors kind of meld together a little bit more. Um, it definitely tastes different like day one versus after you've like cooled it and reheated it. It's delicious both ways. I think you'll love it. And you like to freeze it as well, right? Yeah, so for me, like I said, we use this on everything and I like to have some on hand for like, even when it's just me having lunch. So I'll put them in little individual zip baggies and freeze them flat and then I'll put them all in one big like freezer safe bag to kind of um, not use so many baggies. So let's go ahead and plate it up. Okay. All right, there we go. Do you want a fancy spoon, Mom? Yeah, uh, let's put a serving spoon in it maybe. Decorate it with some fresh cilantro and some lime some wedges. Lime wedges. There we go. So super fast, super easy. I'm sure you're gonna love it. Um, if you have any questions about this recipe, please ask us in the comments below, and we'll get back to you. Be sure and like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video.